Look, we're still at day two. All these boxes, they're about 12, 13 high. And that's a single row right here. But over here, it's a triple, yeah, triple row. So there's about 200 boxes in there. All this stuff is just antiques from the attic. There's a little bit of loose stuff in the bottom. We still have about another 100 boxes in the attic, but they're all Indian stuff, brand new Indian stuff. And probably like 100 baskets. So uh, I got some crazy light going. Oh, there we go. Bam. Look, I, as you can tell, I didn't shave. And I got my face is covered in dirt. So um, my face is covered in dirt, so it's even better. So I'll probably look like 50 years older, a lot fatter, which I'm pretty fat. But you know, still day two, three. We're almost done with this. We're going to go back to the house. We might do a little bit more in the Indian store, and I'm going to send everybody home so they can go take a hot bath, and we'll do it all over again tomorrow. But we're making great progress. Team Bargain Hunter's been working hard. Hey, guys. Day four here of actual, actually day three of moving. Day four since we bought it. I'm in a different room here. This room is kind of creepy. It's like this bed behind me. Everything is preserved. It's like the horror movies when you see when somebody, like, died. And they just keep everything in condition, so. But I found some cool stuff. Let me show you. So all these are paintings, all signed and numbered. They have like $300 price tags, but that was in the 80s, so obviously we have to research them. More dolls. Cool lamp. Awesome nightstands. Check out. That's a really cool looking Bible. And then this room is just filled with these baskets. There's another Victrola right here. It's probably the fifth one. But this one's actually an Edison one. I already played it. And you can see all stuff. Just stuff everywhere. This reminds me of one of the old Nintendo games where you just have the light spark going. So I'm going to work my way over there right now, see what's in the drawers, and on the other side. And then you can see in the far, we've been cleaning all kinds of stuff. Yep, definitely will take 10 days, but five truckloads out. We probably have about eight, 900 boxes out in storage already. By the time we're done, I think we're gonna have about 1,500 boxes, which makes me pretty happy. Hey guys, day four or five. I don't even really know, to be honest. I think it's day four of hard moving, day five since we bought it. We filled up another 12 by 20. So you kind of can see it there in the background a little bit. Uh, the whole bottom base all the way back and you see in the back there's boxes there's probably like 500 boxes in this um you know four or five hundred boxes three or four truckloads then on top right now we're just putting a lot of soft goods like we have a lot of these covered wagons and dolls and different things working with my main guy tyler the newbie jordan still here still trying to impress the boss i was moving fast when i look at him very funny uh, Got like, what do we got in there? Like 100 boxes roughly? Yeah. Another 100 boxes. We're gonna go load up another unit right now. And then we're gonna go back to the house. Got more truck loads going. I'm not gonna lie. At this point, I'm kind of hating life. I'm sicker than hell. Drank half a bottle of Michael last night. But you know what? We gotta get the job done. We got five more days to go, but I feel really confident the team's been working the butt off. They've been working hard. And we're just getting stuff loaded and we'll just continue the battle. So here, another unit, like the one I just showed you guys was the same size, 12 by 20, 240 square feet, and we're like literally in the back section, we stack them way high. Um, so, guys unloading another truck load. Hey Tyler, are you, are you loving life right now? Yeah. Should I buy smaller deals from now on? Probably. Probably. <laughs> Say what? Oh, you don't like to drive one to hill? No. No? No, no, no. It's okay. But hey, we buy big, right, at Bargain Hunters? No, go big or go home, I guess. That, that's right. See, he's learning. I'm rubbing off on him, finally. But as you can of see, like, you saw some stuff in the house. This, hot, this deal is basically two deals. They had a Native American store, so we got all kinds of things that are Native American, you know? Wood carvings and lassos and, you know, those are remakes, just little pots and pans. But they also own an antique store, so half of the stuff is all Native American, the other stuff is antiques. And I mean, that's barely, like we haven't loaded any personals yet, that's another phone down there, we'll probably have 50 phones. You know, thermos. Hey, these are new wallets for the store, I mean, but when you go to the store in Old Town, I mean, these wallets are like, um, you know, 30, 40 bucks usually. We'll probably sell them for 5, 10 bucks. Some kind of light bulbs down there, and dolls, and... I mean, there's just so much Indian baskets. 
I mean, see all those clear little pots on top. Next thing we're gonna get, we got all these Navajo and Apache or clay pottery. And it's just so much stuff. Like, I don't even know how I'm gonna edit all this video. It's just gonna be a long thing, just merchandise, merchandise, merchandise. This is probably the most merchandise I've ever bought. So, and we'll probably, will do like a two or three part video. It's like, this is overwhelming. Well, let me close this up and go help my guys so we can get back to the house and get another load. And the stacking continues. This is another unit, meanwhile. Just stuff. Look how nice this piece is. Suit of armor, it's not the store. Tyler's still hating life. Good times, right? Great times. See, great times. Positive employees make a happy company. Even though he said he was gonna kick me off the stairs earlier, I would buy another house like this. <laughs> Check this out, Budweiser. On tap. Awesome. <sighs> More good stuff.